Iran criticized over shockingly harsh sentencing of human rights lawyer. Amnesty International has blasted the Iranian authorities for handing down a reported 30-year prison sentence and 111 lashes to a human rights lawyer, calling it an outrageous injustice. With this shockingly harsh sentence, Amnesty said, Amir Salar Dawoodi became the latest victim of a vicious crackdown waged by the authorities against human rights lawyers over the past two years. Dawoodi was arrested in November 2018 and has been detained in Tehran's Evin prison with extremely limited access to his family and lawyer, Amnesty said. On June the 1st, Dawoodi's wife tweeted that he had been convicted by the Tehran Revolutionary Court on multiple charges including insulting officials and spreading propaganda against the system and sentenced to 30 years in prison and 111 lashes. During the 2018 uprising, 4,600 youth were arrested in Iran. Revolutionary Guard ideologue Hassan Abbasi, in an interview on state television, acknowledged that during the 2018 uprising, about 4,600 young people were arrested by repressive forces. He rejected the possibility of any velvet revolution or color revolution in Iran and said, what happened in 2018 was 4,500 to 4,600 of these young people in the street who were arrested. Stressing that political prisoners are subject to torture and executions, the Iranian resistance has called for urgent action by the Secretary General of the United Nations, the UN High Commissioner and the Human Rights Council and international human rights organizations to release the detainees and to designate delegations to visit regime prisons and to meet with political prisoners. Sabal Kord Afshari re-arrested Civil activist and former political prisoner Sabal Kord Afshari has been re-arrested. She had been released from Evin prison in February 2019. Holding her arrest warrant, security forces went to Sabal's home in Tehran on Saturday, June 1st. They inspected the house, confiscated some of her personal belongings, including her cell phone and laptop computer, and took her to the detention center on Vozaro Avenue. Saba was arrested with Yasamin Ariani during protests in Tehran in August 2018. Both were sentenced to a year in prison. The two young women were transferred from Qarchak prison to Evin after their verdict was issued. Protests by teachers and municipality workers in Iran. A group of kindergarten teachers rallied on Monday in different cities across Khuzestan province in southwest Iran, protesting officials' refusal to upgrade their job status from part-time to full-time contracts. They have been working on part-time contracts since 2013 and are demanding changes be made to their job status immediately. Municipality workers in the Kut Abdullah district of Ahvaz rallied on Monday once again this month outside the governor's office demanding their delayed paychecks. Around 250 municipality workers and 90 administrative employees are protesting paycheck delays during the past two months, the workers have said. One protester said his February paycheck was never fully paid. <laughs>